Welcome back. Today I'm going to show you on a Bryant uh, furnace how to change out your air filter <clears throat> when it's time. Pay attention to your airflow direction of flow, the size you're replacing, and if you want to add a date, you can. Next thing you do is you get your uh, air filter ready, pop the panel off. Some of them are on different on different units. And they're going to be a lower door, maybe, maybe not. Some might have it on the side right here where your uh, return is coming in. In this case, it's going to be right here. Let's get a little light on the subject. There we go. I've got a little stick here to help it, um, to support it from not coming around the air filter and my airflow is flowing this direction yeah it's dusty and dirty it's time to change it You can see dirt on there and stuff like that. This is also good for during the pandemic. Keep the coronavirus on your filter. And uh, you'll want to make sure you change it out. It's good for your health. Try not to be a penny saver and just change it when you're supposed to be changing it. And that way, uh, Everybody feels a little bit healthier in the home. You'll have to kind of make sure that gets fitted right back where it goes, like that. And put your stick here. I, I, I like it because look how it can kind of come around and try to skip the air filter. So I use this to kind of, uh, oh, like a strengthening on it. And then this furnace is just kind of tiny bit small, just a little bit. There we go. Almost. Might be the stick just a little bit, but you could get just one size a little bit smaller, just a little bit, but to make sure it's covering your overall. See, I, I like putting this here. It helps. It helps it so that the uh, air can't quite come around. There is a little bit of an opening up there, so you're going to want to scoot your, scoot that up. Make sure it's covering it, so that it's not going to cheat. So, yeah, make sure you check it. Retighten this back up again. There. And a little bit more up. And I know that sounded awkward, but you gotta got to get your air filter in place. Or otherwise, you're, you're only getting maybe, that's better, so much of it filtered that it's going around your air filter and not really doing its job. It's like having an automotive air filter and you are uh, got a hole in the, of that air filter and skipping it. Anyway, other than that, make sure you wear your mask and change out your air filter and change out your old one and keep down that coronavirus if you want other than that i hope that that will help you out you can do some wiping down and make sure things stay clean in here this is where they do their fine tuning if they come out and service your furnace they fine tune it and they look at the flames how it's coming out and it's just right and then this is your other little uh, fan here that throws out your exhaust. And then this is a little pressure diaphragm here. And it has a pressure detecting of the airflow. And as it gets sucked in on the diaphragm, then it closes the switch. And then goes to the next. And goes to the circuit board. And it ensures that, that your flame front is coming on. The uh, glow, glow stick or the uh, igniter. 
which is good. And this is checked out, and that's checked out, and then all this, everything gets closed on the circuit, then it will open up this valve here and let the fuel flow and, and light. So, anyway, that's kind of the quick basic, and then you have your door switch here to clo help close the circuit. Then you have your main switch, which is shut off right here. This will shut off your gas. And uh, this is kind of the basic explanation that is giving you your furnace. I hope that helps out, and then that's how you change out your, your filter. If you don't feel comfortable changing it, then uh, you can have somebody else do it for you. Or maybe an elderly would like to have it done. It's kind of funny that circuit board is just kind of hanging there all this time. Should have that button popped in. Okay. You guys have a good one and hope all is good. Stay safe and hope we get through this pandemic sooner. Thumbs up and wish you all best.